So in Asia Pacific region we have a huge diversity of countries um, from very different maturity levels. Uh, we've got the most sophisticated e-commerce markets in the world like China, Japan, South Korea. On the other hand we've got Thailand, Philippines, Indonesia and Vietnam. We've got some of the most emerging markets and the biggest potential moving forward. Asia Pacific is all home to the largest population across the world. China and India together account for over two and a half billion people and ASEAN as well um, is a growing market. Uptake is high with startups, personal wealth is driving many market entrants and local brands are really competing fiercely alongside their international counterparts to claim market share. The big debate is really cross-border versus local market presence. We've got you know, a lot of customers looking to go cross-border, equally many establishing a local market presence to ensure the lead time to their customers um, is as short as possible. The key thing then is inventory versus lead time and how many multiple inventory instances you have across your supply chain um, in order to maximise the service to the customers, but also to optimise cost at the same time. For our customers' supply chain, the key aspect is matching the customer expectation with the service level that B2C offers. One key element of that is flexibility. With so many special events across Asia Pacific, the flex needed in labour and facilities at certain times of the year really does put the supply chain under pressure. We need to plan for that and be ready for that. Being resilient is key, making sure that our customers aren't over dependent on one single channel in any one geography, therefore omni-channel comes into play and having inventory in the right place across the facilities to ensure that service to the customer is maximised. For DHL we just launched Strategy 2025. The number one pillar of that strategy is the safety and well-being of our employees that they come to work and leave work in a safe manner and are engaged with both our customers and also the people around them. The customer-focused approach um, builds on that and is really around how we can help our customers go omni-channel across multiple countries in a consistent manner with best-in-class IT, solutions and properties across all 15 markets. To own tomorrow, we're investing now in warehouse automation, robotics and analytics and we really do feel that we are the only company that's able to offer single elements as well as the entire e-commerce supply chain on a global scale. We've been handling large-scale operations across e-commerce since 2005 in all Asia markets. Our sheer breadth and diversity of business enables us to help you with your omni-channel strategy. If you'd like to talk to us, please reach out, we can collaborate with you.